Trocando de arma. Trocando de arma! Recarregando! Agora estou recarregado! What is up, everybody? A TGN FPS. Yo, hanging with Hardy Tech. Lucky yo, yo. I'm TGN FPS's newest director, and I know you guys have been seeing a lot of introduction videos lately. Just people telling you who they are and what they do and why they do it and all. So I'm going to try to be a little different. I'm going to get through the introductions as soon as possible and move on to some other topics. All right. So I'm 16 years old. I'm a senior in high school, and I'm just a big Call of Duty fan, man. That's right, I ain't your average fanboy. I'm all man, baby. <laughs> I'm not, I don't just play Call of Duty, though. I like Battlefield. I first got into Battlefield during the beta. I had a lot of fun. I'm definitely going to be picking the game up when it comes out on the 25th. So I don't just play Call of Duty. All, and this kind of going along with it. I mainly post Call of Duty videos on my channel, but for a long time, that's pretty much been the only game i played. But now that Battlefield's going to be coming out soon, I'm definitely going to be posting some of that. So I'm not just going to be your average Call of Duty commentator. All right? Kind of moving on a bit, I want to tell you guys how I got on TGN FPS. Because I know there's probably a lot of you out there that are sending messages in saying, Can you please let me be a director? Can you partner me? Can I get on? Blah, 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 blah. I'm going to be running you guys through the steps on how I got on FPS, how it happened, and all that. Now, I don't know if this is a common occurrence, occurrence, but I actually got to skip TGN Idol. I don't know if a lot of commentators do this, but I ha I got a chance to skip Idol. What I did was I sent an application in to TGN Idol, and then I sent an email to George, who is the CEO of TGN, asking if I could skip TGN Idol because I don't think I need it. I believe it was the next day he replied back saying that he agrees that he doesn't think I need TGN Idol and uh, contact him on Skype so he can welcome me to the director family program thing. <laughs> There's a bit of, of confusion though because a few days later I got an email saying I was accepted into TGN Idol and to add uh, the heads of Idol to start posting and I'm like but I already got accepted into director's family why am I going on Idol? And it took about 15 days because I couldn't get a response from anybody. I would send George messages every day. I would send the people I was told to add messages. And I never got any kind of response But because I know they're all busy. I mean, they're running a freaking company, for God's sakes. Of course, they're going to be busy. But finally, I was able to get in touch with Harley, who is the head of all the TGN hubs. And he pointed me over to TGN Odin, who is the channel manager of SP FPS. I sent him an email showing my best video. I believe it was Odin. It might have been someone else. I think it was actually William. I don't know. I sent an email to somebody showing my best video. And then, yeah, I sent an email to William showing my best video. And then I got sent over to TGN Odin, who is the channel manager at FPS. We got talking. He sent me all the stuff I had to do to complete the process. And here I am, posting my very first video on TGN FPS. It is such an honor to be here on this channel. TGN is such an awesome place to be. In my opinion, when you compare companies like Yaosh and Machinima and the Game Station, TGN is really kind of just different overall. It's uh, more, It feels more like a community. I mean, with Machinima, if you're not in Machinima, then you're not going to have any contact with Machinima machines, it seems. But with TGN, you can go on their website. It's like Facebook. You can be friends with anybody. George, the CEO, is friendly. He talks to people. The people who run the channels, they're nice. They'll answer your questions. They'll help you out. It's just a big, friendly environment, and it's super awesome to be here, and it's even better to be a part of this awesome channel now, so I just, I can't really explain my feelings for being here. I know I'm probably sounding very weird right now. I'm, I apologize for that, but... Once, if you guys ever make it on to TGN, any of the TGN channels, or if you already are, then you know what I'm talking about. You know what it's like to be a part of a channel that's just, like, it's awesome. It's just an awesome channel. Now, in the last few minutes I got left here, I want to tell you guys about what I want to be doing uh, here on TGN FPS. And I'm sorry if you heard that, a car just drove by and I forgot to close my window. <laughs> Also, I live right next to a motorcycle shop, so that makes it kind of hard to do commentary sometimes. Anyways, some of the things I want to do here on TGN FPS is maybe a live commentary series. I want to call it maybe like In the Mind of a Yo-Yo or a Yo-Yo Mindset, something like that. You know, Hardy Tech Yo-Yo, I'm sure you guys can figure that much out. And just doing some live comms, I really love Modern Warfare 2 Search and Destroy. That's pretty much the only game mode I play on Modern Warfare 2 anymore. 
So I might do some search and destroy to tell you guys like what's going through my mind, what I'm thinking when I'm in a gunfight, about to go into a gunfight, when I'm sound horn, when I'm planning. Let's tell you guys what I'm thinking because I like to think I'm a slightly above average player. I mean I'm not your average Call of Duty player but I'm not like a super duper tryhard who gets 15 sets of dogs every game. Um, I like to think I'm somewhere in the middle. I also want to do something I haven't seen on TGN yet and that is a let's play. Maybe uh, I was wanted to do a Modern Warfare 2 campaign let's play, kind of like get pumped up for Modern Warfare 3 in less than a month, I can't wait for that. And I haven't seen anybody else do any let's plays here on TGN, but I haven't gone through all the videos yet, so I might be wrong. <laughs> there probably is a let's play, and I'm probably sounding like an idiot right now. But if you guys want to see a let's play, definitely tell me and I'll do it. Well, you could also see it on a different game, I could do World at War, I could do Black Ops, I could do Modern Warfare 2, I could do uh, Gears of War 2. I also have, I think, uh, I think those are the only games I have right now, I'll have to go check, but I think doing a let's play would be pretty cool, either live commentated or commentated after I record it, I'm not sure which one I would prefer to do, I think let's plays are better when they're live commentated, it's just, it's weird doing it pre-recorded, it's freaky, doesn't seem, or pre-recorded, I don't know if that's right, just doesn't seem natural, well, I mean, let's play should be like what you're thinking when you're playing a campaign, it should be like you experiencing something like when building explodes you're like oh shit what was that you know you should be freaking out when you're playing a let's play you should feel like you're actually playing the game but yeah do you guys want to see a let's play if so what game do you guys want me to do finally i'm gonna be just doing some random crap you can see on every other channel on youtube but with my personal hearty tech yo yo touch and don't worry it's not a sexual offense because i'm under 16 and i don't think you could be tried for that if you're under if you're a minor that was a very weird thing to say. I wish I didn't say that. But I don't like to cut things out. I want you guys to know me, Hardy Tech Yo Yo. And all right, that's pretty much all I had to talk about. So, yeah, wait up. These guys were like the anti kill streak guys. Two choppers shot down within like the first five seconds. Drove me insane. So, to, for the last little bit here, I'm just going to tell you guys about what I like to do on my channel, some of the things I do. Some of the things I want to do, I have done, and I think you guys get the picture. So, over on my channel, I do this one series particularly that is super popular over on my channel. Everybody thinks it's a good idea. I've had a machinima partner do it with me, but sadly I had to remove it because somehow it got copyrighted. That was weird. But I don't know what happened. But it's called the Call of Duty Game Show. What I do is I take a fellow subscriber. No, not, it doesn't have to be a subscriber. I just take a fellow commentator in general off of YouTube, and I quiz them seven questions based on Call of Duty. Everyone's favorite game. Look at that, come here, no launch. Oh my god! <laughs> and I quiz them on Call of Duty. I ask them seven questions, increasingly difficult, and see how well they know everybody's favorite game. The reason why they're making commentaries in Call of Duty. And if they can get it right, then, you know, obviously they're a Call of Duty expert and blah blah blah. And if they get it wrong, which every single person that's been on the game show so far has lost, usually around question five and six, so... Obviously, it starts out easy and gets more difficult, but everybody really likes the idea. I think I'm like the first person ever to do something like this. I may or may not be. It's real because it's really hard to find original ideas nowadays on YouTube, especially in the Call of Duty world. So thinking of something like this, I really am proud of the series, and I'm really happy that people love the series. It makes me, makes me feel so happy inside that I just, I really think you guys should come over to my channel, which you can see up in the corner of the video there's a little annotation there taking you to my channel watch some of the call of duty game show episodes you guys can enter to be on the game show just go to the most recent edition leave a comment saying i want to be on the game show and very soon i believe at the end of uh, the next episode i'm going to pick the next contestant for it based off who wrote a comment all right guys that is the end of the gameplay and right now i want to tell you guys over on the left side of the screen you can actually go watch the most recent edition of the Call of Duty game show. It was with SX101, a fellow YouTube commentator. Just go watch the show. I'm sure you guys will like it. And then leave a comment saying you want to be on it. Over on the right side, you can see what I've been told is one of my best personal commentaries. It was me talking about a time I almost died a few years ago. No, I think it was when I was six. Anyways, it's me talking about a time I almost died. It's my first ever commentary talking about something personal to me. And it was a little out of my comfort zone, but people really seem to like it. Alright guys, thank you for watching. On behalf of TGN FPS, I'm Hardy Tech Yo-Yo, sign out. Peace, guys.